and here in Loch La Hong, and it's just you know you got the beatiness and the hectness of the restaurants, and yeah. really to get back to nature. Yeah, you're not in Kansas anymore, Dorothy. This has <laughs> nothing to do with the way the bustle and the hustle and the daily regimen is within the restaurants in Bali. And you know, we live in a beautiful tropical place. True. And we never really take the benefit of it. No. Because it's always restaurant, restaurant, restaurant. Not a lot of days at the beach. Welcome to the jungle. I've taken us to this place where I'm going to start cooking some traditional dishes. Yeah. Based on everything we learned yesterday, we've decided it's in our best interest to give it a go ourselves. Cooking rice and fish with inside bamboo. So the first step of being a Dayak and the most important part of your meal is of course always the rice. They just shake it up and down and it's about the clarity of the water. And then they give a little shimmy a shimmy. A shimmy shimmy. Yeah, that's crucial. It's now to my dishwasher to clean the dishes. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Jungle cleaning. And again, also, it's very important to clean your leaves. So we're going to keep cleaning all this stuff. Bamboo's clean, leaves clean, rice clean, clean. under the fire. So we're back in our makeshift kitchen. So we've created a fire. And the next step is, is to fold the rice into parcels. So the rice basically is going to go in. Fold it over. The leaf then gets folded over. And then we stick that into here. There we go. Perfect. And we need to put some water in there as well. Yeah, so I'll go to the river, river get some water. Put a little bit of water. In the meantime, let me explain a little bit about what the ingredients are. Basically, we've got patin fish. Bumbu kuning that they have here, which basically in here is candle nut. You've got garlic, you've got a little bit of shallot, you've got some galangal, you've got some lemongrass in here as well. The next step is you've also got some chopped ingredients here, which are basically green chili. You've also got shallot, you've also got tomato, you've got some garlic that gets chopped up and gets marinated with the fish itself. Then also we're going to put in traditional kachombra. There's different types of kachombra, but this one is like the big kind of ball of it and you take these skin of the seed and you take this here and then you basically peel this into your fish mixture. So then the next step is we have to prepare the fish and just rinse that off there and we're going to mix the fish in with that. Fish in. Yep, chuck it in. Then we're going to add in our paste and then the ingredients here which so we'll mix that in. I'm going to add a little bit of this yeah. to it. So here we got salt. Yeah, mix that through. Sugar, same amount or half? Tiny a pinch. There you go. And then we're going to go with this little uh, ingredient here, which is like the ginger flour. And we're just going to break some of this off. So ah. we take these seeds in. There you go. Yeah. Now we need to stuff this into here. Put them in there. Now let's get some leaves in here. Yeah. And we'll chuck this in. Place this on here. And we'll allow this to probably cook for about 30 minutes maybe because the bamboo is a bit thicker. Okay, so I think we're ready. I'll hold it just like that. <laughs> you give it a big whack. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here we go. Right, so we'll pick some fish up from here. And this is exactly what we've done. We've created a fantastic meal out of nothing in the jungle. So next thing is the rice. <laughs> that was close. Just missed. Well done. Oh, look at that. It's cooked. Yeah, that's not hot at all. And this is actually turmeric leaf that they've wrapped it in. And that is a really hearty meal for anybody. And this, I suppose, wraps up our, our Dayak experience for the past couple of days. Agree. The challenge was recreating the experience of that traditional cooking that in the Dayak region. We, I mean, We've come pretty close. I think so. And it's not far off what we had yesterday. <laughs>